we are re-engineering ourselves. So Kenyans should not give up hope. The trouble with us in Kenya is you vote and you don't know what happens to your vote. But we are coming to the end of that torture because our world view is changing. As I speak to you, a very good friend of mine called Duma Boko has won by a landslide in Botswana, making President Masisi one term. Now Masisi has even conceded as we speak. That is how democracy should now begin to work. So Kenyans, if you hear Ruto will be one term, you begin to say, Ataiba, Atafanyeka Namnaga, it will not happen because times have changed. The time when your vote will matter has come. Mishmua Governor Abinja, hold fast the county. If you are doing that road from uh, Katangi to Kilimani, right? And, and even out there in Mulolongo and other places, work. But as you work, also relate to your people properly as it should be. Okay? Assisted by a very able senator here. When you take a position, people stick to it. Because that is what has made people ambao ni wakina waititu waongea vila wanaongea waliwanekana mulionyesha njini watu wawepa muna msumamu imarishia ni msumamu na muwache vita kidogo kidogo hapa hai tutatua hui to impeach speaker to impeach nani because you know if you do that then you have to come to the party leader I'm sorry I'm talking about this for a fool it might be boring yeah but you know they engage you at that stage we don't want that the time for real change and liberation, the national liberation of Kenya is the issue that is at hand. We, we feel honored that um, this has happened, the launch of this one acre rule, smart farming. And, 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 and I think the climax to me was when I had to press the button. By pressing that button, I've invited Kenyan youth, African youth, to go for farming. To go for farming. And go for smart farming. If we can utilize every acre and do value addition, the future of this continent will be bright. You know, we used to talk of the Asian tigers the time for the African lion has come. Thank you. Thank you, Bishop Masika, for making Kenyans and Africans think out of the box.